Hello YouTube, today I'll be giving you a big old video on update 2. Now, this is how I'm going to work on this update. I'm going to start at the back and then make my way down, giving as many details as I can on what I have done. So you can kind of, so you guys can kind of see my thinking and everything, everything. Okay. Okay. Now starting back here, I I destroyed the showman I had and added a cool sticker to show the bullet hole. Now, in games I play like World of Tanks and War Thunder. Some of the coolest uh, deaths in tanks are Amorax. And the just flames burst out the top. And then usually, after a while, the ammo actually explodes. And the torch just pops off. Now, I didn't want to do that one. But I did want to have the file coming out. So I added this really cool big like file piece. I only have one of these. I don't know where I got it from. It, it's definitely Lego, but I don't know what sets these big fire pieces come from. Now I have flame coming out of the back and smoke, and then I have just like spare ammo and shells and stuff. Like sandbag and this guy diving out, or maybe he'll just be dead, I don't know, but there's fire coming out of there. Then moving down, um, I ran out of big uh like dark tan bricks so i just used the light sand ones and then put different colors we got this box here or it's more of a barrel and then we have this fun little keep out sign um and then we just have like storage here now moving on more greebling walkway path into the uh, trench system and then like a bush and then a tree I used to say these were trees no they're not trees they're bushes now we have a whole bunch of storage here machine gun this is American the machine guns are actually in their own section then we have um, boxes helmets more boxes plants and um, sandbags we have more plants and flowers. I had a lot of these flowers, so they came in handy. And then finally got the broken Jeep uh, finished. Then I have just bumps here and there with different things. This one's just plain. This one has a couple boxes on it. This one has a tank, um, tank trap. Um, you see these a lot in the Normandy. Um, then I have just a box here and there. Ignore this. This is just, I like to put stuff I'm building just sitting here. Um, again with that. Oh, what else? Oh, yeah. It's a graduate uh, just ramp down. And I think it looks nice. Um, now over here, the main part. So, I exhausted every single... Um, Lego plant type thing that I had like there's nothing left I dug through this entire box here I went through my Lego bag um, I emptied out some of my boxes here and s stuff I don't have any more I literally took every single one I had so this mock uses a lot of my resources. Um, so in here, let's lower that down. Um, there is an MG, I think it's MG34 German uh, machine gun. And we got just plants here and there, uh, like a little bit of a pathway and just stuff every uh, here and there as well. Um, we have like a little bit of a storage depot um, and then this is going to be like a little hill. It's not so much a mountain as it is just a hill. Um, then back here, we just have stuff in the knockdown tree. And then we have like a natural tall tree. 
because when you're using Kobe tanks, you need to make sure your trees are tall. Um, then we have like the, when the tanks drive, you see this a lot more in War Thunder. They make dents in the ground because of how heavy they are. So I wanted to simulate that. Though, actually, it's not a dent. It actually comes up, but still looks cool. Again, this is just a placeholder for the Tiger. Here's a more, here's a better look at the late German installation there. And you know what? Next video, I'll actually, uh, yeah, I'll put more guys and maybe add more detail. Um, if, if you have any suggestions or ideas please let me know in the comment section um i would love to hear what you guys think about this and if you have any thoughts on how to improve it bye